The ISO-AMP HSV assay is a rapid in vitro diagnostic test for the direct qualitative detection of the herpes simplex viruses type 1 and type 2 in genital and oral lesions. The ISO-AMP HSV assay consists of three major steps, sample preparation, amplification, and detection. Sample prep consists of a simple one-step dilution in which specimens and viral transport medium are diluted 40-fold in dilution buffer. The diluted samples are mixed with helicase-dependent amplification or HDA reagents. Incubation at 64 degrees Celsius results in the release of the HSV DNA and subsequent isothermal amplification of the target sequence. This, in turn, eliminates the need for expensive thermocycling equipment. After a one-hour incubation, a lateral flow strip embedded in a self-contained disposable cassette which prevents contamination allows colorimetric detection of the HSV target. In a typical BioHelix ISO-AMP HSV assay kit, you will find dilution tubes, amplification reagents, enzyme reagents, HSV1 assay positive control, HSV2 assay positive control, and assay negative control. The kit also comes with cassettes, mineral oil, disposable transfer pipettes, reaction tubes, and cassette disposal bags. We have placed an amplification reagent tube, blue cap, an enzyme reagent tube, red cap, and a 2.0 dilution tube pre-filled with dilution buffer in a cooling block. Transfer 25 microliters of viral transport medium from the collection vial to a corresponding dilution tube. Mix the solution well by inverting the tube five times. Centrifuge the dilution tube in a mini micro centrifuge for approximately five seconds. Transfer 25 microliters of the diluted sample to the corresponding 0.2 milliliter reaction tube. Keep the tube in a cooling block. Prepare the master mix by transferring 25 microliters of enzyme reagent, the red cap, to the amplification reagent tube, in the blue cap. You must mix the solution thoroughly by pipetting the solution up and down at least five times. Add 25 microliters of the master mix to the 25 microliter diluted sample in the 0.2 milliliter reaction tube. Drop two to three droplets of mineral oil to the reaction tube using a disposable transfer pipette. Place the reaction tube in a 64 degrees Celsius heat block for 60 minutes. Remove the reaction tube from 64 degrees Celsius after 60 minutes. Place the tube in a rack at room temperature. Tear open a new cassette package. Place the reaction tube into the Amplicon cartridge. Be sure to place the hinge of the tube cap into the largest slot adjacent to the buffer bulb. Let's see that in live action. Close the Amplicon cartridge and make sure that it snaps shut. Insert the closed Amplicon cartridge into the detection chamber. Make sure the arrow located on the top of the Amplicon cartridge faces the detection strip. Keep the device upright and squeeze the handle of the outer casing to close. The handle will lock into place when closed completely. Read the result after 15 minutes. Always read the test or T-line first. When a T-line is visible, report the assay result as HSV DNA detected or positive. When no visible T-line is present, and a visible C-line eliminates the possibility of a false negative, the test result is negative. There is no nucleic acid extraction, no instruments to purchase, and no cross-contamination, making BioHelix's ISO-AMP HSV assay easy to use, cost-effective, and accurate, not to mention a rapid total turnaround time of just 90 minutes. For more information, 
Call 978-927-5056 or a toll-free number at 866-800-5458 or visit our website at www.biohelix.com.